think? Who's gonna win the series today? Oh, okay. uh, yeah, Tim Luke, Tim Luke is gonna win. Okay. I actually thought fucking C C9 would win today. This is unbelievable. After C9 got booty blasted last week by Fly, I actually did oh. not think that they would not take the following weeks uh, or week of practice like super serious. And I think all of their players individually are much better than TLs. I just refuse to believe that they would actually find a way to lose, but maybe the systems are just actually that good. I mean, right now I can see on my screen that one team has Cassante and the other one doesn't, so... No, I mean, but I just realized that Clownin has two drakes somehow. Been there <laughs> yeah. many times. They have two drakes, actually, with the comp that should never have two drakes in the early game, yeah. Oh my god. Wait, is he dead? Or JJ is just dead, no? Wait, is he gonna live? Wait, why? Wait, he didn't flash. What? He could have just flashed and lived. Okay, so TL is... Wait, I... Wait, what is... How... What is even happening this game, by the way? See, like... What is happening like, is Berserker is split pushing and TL is just pushing and then dancing in the jungle for the yeah, past three like, minutes. It just seems like TL is just arbitrarily pushing and C9 is just dying and turrets are falling. There's no yeah, game. Yeah, but by. that's exact... But that's exact... No, but that's exactly what I told you five minutes ago that they don't have... So there is a poke team comp against... Uh... Yeah, like team comp that does uh, everything all over the place, right? They don't have like an engage to actually beat the poke team comp. Oh, They're just kind of lost right now. Oh, what the f***? Oh. I mean, they feel, pre they feel pressure to do something because they are just eating shit slowly. I feel it. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> man. This whole game is just so disorganized, I can't even focus. He can't even focus. Okay. All right. They kill APA. They kill APA. APA is dead. All right. All right. All right. They give kill. All right. They give shutdown to Fudge. Okay. Like purely theoretically speaking, this uh, APA guy he likes to play stuff like Zig Zerat, right? From what I know. Yeah. Am I wrong? Yeah. So they should, like <clears throat> technically shouldn't should never give him Liquid Varus because that's gonna make them play like their ultimate comfort, right? Yeah. Unless you have something prepared against that, then that's a different story, but doesn't seem like that's a good Oof. preparation. Wait, there's a team fight happening. Yeah, 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 but I, I mean, what, 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 no one can follow up with Blabber. It's just, uh, this team comp, like, can't do anything, man. Just can't Cassandra do anything. Doing Cassandra things. Oh, oh, but maybe, oh, no bailout. Oh, Berserker, not enough damage. Kind of surprised at how little there is uh, the gold lead for Team Liquid, because it looks like they're just stomping the entire game. Yeah. But I mean, they're gonna get Baron now, so now, now game I think is actually over. C9 has no way to get Baron. They have the turrets, but my point is every time all the players are on the same screen, then it's just one sided. What do you think about Renekton in this comp? Uh, he looks kinda useless, honestly. Like, Lane <laughs> yes. is 50 50, but oh, honestly. Oh, 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 were you calling him useless? Hold on. Hold on. He's gonna be a flash Here he is. Here he is. Flash w, no oh flash my w. god, my BBC. No, he's broken. He thought oh you my was... god, Renekton! <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, do they still, lose, still the lose the fight? Wait, wait they still again. lose the fight! There'll be a Pentaki, by the way. <laughs> oh my god, Renekton literally takes out two people for free, they still <laughs> lose. <laughs> I have to just see that again. <laughs> Wait, but they can't really win early game, no? Cloud9, after the counter pick support. This is so crazy. Wait, but what happened to Berserker? Wait. Okay. When you, but look, Jax is not winning that fight when it started. That's the funniest thing. Oh, oh, Berserker just goes down too. Oh, we got bailed. Yeah. Nah, okay. So, Berserker had, like, the worst Senna game of all time, followed by the best Senna game of all time, back to having an awful Senna game. Like, it was actually pure coincidence, the best Senna game. I think they're, they're actually... Why, why would you blind Lee? Self-made, please. Tell me that you think Lee sucks. I unironically think he's in the strongest spot he ever was right now. <laughs> Which, look, 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 I would still not pick him because oh, okay. if, they, if they pick my okay right now, he, can he play the game? Okay, alright, thank you. Alright, nice save, nice save on that one, nice save. 
but but it's true there is eclipse and there is sunset sky these items are like so broken on him right now i like how you or put like that. Or, or like volleyball and then be stronger early game and just don't let him do anything right True. And then they pick support that's not proactive, that's reactive, so... Like, doesn't make any fucking sense. If you, if you no wanna pick Lee like that, then I don't know, just commit to playing some Kalista Nautilus type of draft, right? And flip the whole 10 minutes of the game. Picking him like that and then picking Tamkent, I mean, mm -hmm. again, they're gonna end up winning the game most likely, and then we're gonna be the clowns, right? Mm -hmm. Dive top, wave free. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> what are we drafting? Uh yeah uh okay the way I mean the 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 way pick is like the only thing that can maybe save the draft. Everything else is. I don't like the C9 draft at all. No, C9 draft is yeah. bad. But yeah, like I don't know wh why do you even try to pick your Nick on least in as like a top jungle do that sounds really bad. Oh, I mean I, I guess people point. that play why wait they saw he saw that right surely no he saw no that. no it's the it's spectator bug if you see the pet. oh is it okay <gasps> now we saw him. <laughs> Wait, Impact didn't have to flash that early. Oh, that sucks. He look, look, Volibear Champion's gonna have one nine days. Nah, Impact fucked up. He played that bad. He played it bad. Wait, what? Blabber? What? What? Oh, that was Fudge's fault, actually, I think. I think that was actually Fudge's fault. Uh, how was that Fudge's fault? Oh, no, C9 subreddit will tell us that was Fudge's fault. Ah, uh, I don't know the memes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> C9, that was Fudge's fault, by the way. <laughs> was, don't like wait, how did he just fly? Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, that was Fudge's fault, though. Okay, this is bad, though. Three, uh, I mean, okay, three Void Grub. Oh, Core has to. Okay, this is actually a pretty big advantage for C9, though, in bottom, no? To be fair, the, the Rumble Jungle meta was the funniest one when he had to start double to stack his passive. Yeah. And then you invade him level 1, like late invade, you kill him and then he has to come back without stacks and fire his comes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They shot. Did that happen to someone at MSI or World? It's nothing I know it was. Oh my god, wait. Is Berser oh wait, Berserker just flashed out. What is Umpty doing? Wait, is Umpty just dead? No, 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 he's fine. Wait, APA. Whoa, what is APA doing? Wait. What? Happy this is a like fucking... Them. This is a ma- Oh my god. Okay. Alright, MT gets the kill, okay. On the Gromp, I mean, Jesus. Yeah. Done? Still hiding? Wait. Nah, what is C9 doing? Oh my god, wait, wait. No, but wait, what is TL doing? Wait. Wait. Oh my god. Oh my. And now. Cor I mean, he was dead. <laughs> okay, this but this is, is, this but is this fun to watch at least. <laughs> it is. <laughs> yeah, it's fun. It is. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Or yeah. But to be fair, uh, I, I, I wish you could just see on the score. But like when you press tab, like the perfect summoner timings, like objectives, for example, I think it would actually improve the game by a lot. I mean, Riot's probably going to add it. I actually do wonder... Okay, by the way, they're going to... TL is going to have six Void Grubs. I mean, I mean it's only it, just one Towers. Yes, because they have, like, with, three with unique lands. With hit the towers, right? So. Yeah, yeah, with Tristana, too. Like, like in, this case, in this case, it's, cool. it's, it's, like, it's like one of the rare cases when Grubs are actually good for the whole draft, right? Yeah. But normally, I don't think this objective is that good. True. I think it's a bait. Because every time you start Grubs, your bot lane is left alone, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, exactly. Just like right now. <laughs> oh, APA? Trying to kill. Oh. Oh, wow. Nice, nice focus firing. Wow, really nice. Wait. Wow, he actually has. Class, pretty... yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they He's actually. Them. No, I mean, they'll around. definitely kill. They'll definitely kill, but he had actually really good movement. Oh, it was actually a pretty good See, movie. guys, this is what happens 9 out of 10 times when you do Void Grabs. Oh, Blabber stopped. Okay. Alright. I mean, they got Mountain Drake, which is actually super... Okay. Alright, I'm T. Yeah, I'm T is just dead. Fucking Volley Bear, man. Now you're gonna hit on the Volley Bear champion. <laughs> I always am, dude. I always... Of course I will. <laughs> of course I will. <laughs>
Oh, that sucks. You've... Wow, that was a late flash. Yeah, I told the Eclipse is broken on this one. Yeah. What I'm not getting is how is the gold score even? Probably like that they're giving up waves right? to play things. Like, yeah, yeah. Are shielding me to the tower now. I guess, yeah, I guess, I guess. I'm just so, I'm so startled by this, yeah. Just ask yourself what did you eat today and then you answer yourself. I think I, 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 think I ate, I think I ate three double cheeseburgers, no buns, and then I ate a pork cutlet. You ate three double cheeseburgers without buns? Yeah. All right, Fudge is dead. What, but, 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 but why, are, why are C9 even here, man? What's the objective? Herald. Oh, okay, Herald. I was just making sure. Wait, no, they just lost the fucking game over Harold, man! I'm going to get vanilla ice cream. No, but imagine like the people that are like delivering you the food, like, you know, like, free, like, bur like, cheeseburger without a bun, you know? Wait, They're probably tilted dead. delivering it. And they're probably dead for this. Mm, are they both dead? Yeah, they're both yeah. dead. Ah, it's a, it's a, it's a big win. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, equalizer was actually pretty big. Wait, 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 impact. Whoa, what are you? Uh, okay. That's a huge way ultimate. They don't have APA for this. What are they doing? Why do they do that? Like they had, they had the way. Like, look at Tristana with the two void grubs. Actually, gross. But how come they are doing it so quick? Is Kraken Slayer that broken? That had been so broken objectives. Tristana, Tristana is nuts, yeah. Just two fucking oh, items, this is such a This is such a smart sneak. This is actually such a fucking smart sneak. Can you- Oh my god, dude! LCS, please, man! Show me C9's faces! Yeah, well, yeah, I just want to see the faces. They need to get a reaction, right? Yeah, 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 surely there's a reaction. Surely there is. And <laughs> guys, yes! <laughs> oh, shit. That's fucking good. Do you, you don't have this in LEC that people like show the chat now on stream? No, 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 they do it in LCS. It's kind of like a new thing. Cool, though, not gonna lie. Hmm. But I think it's a new thing, though. Yeah. No, I was I was talking about Reptile before the stream. Uh, because Reptile, alright, so Reptile's gained, like, 42,000 Twitter followers in under a year. And I was talking about Ooh. how he, like, developed more, oh my god! Nah, it's just over. C9 just can't you win a what, team fight. You know, you, know, you know what else Reptile did? What? No, I know, I know, I know. He almost got cancelled. No, no, listen. No, I'm not talking about this. Six hours ago, he died level 2 to Vladimir playing Vayne top lane in my game. 1v1 <laughs> How does that happen, bro? Is Vladimir broken or something? I mean, okay, at this point they can technically play with... Okay, wait, wait, no, to the hook. Oh wow. my god, that was a good equalizer. That was a really good equalizer. Nah, it, it's over now. Yeah, it's Fuck over. Fuck the equalizer, that was a very good Nautilus engage. Yeah, that was a good Nautilus hook too, yeah. No, everything was good. It, it was like a pixel so perfect, over. actually, Nautilus wait. engage. Yeah. If Tristan had pink with her, she would have like killed them all. Could have like pink with her, really like the same idea. This is a wave clear here. Okay, then uh, pick proper red draft, you know what I mean? Yeah, at least right that way. What, yeah. if, what if a red draft played mean? Uh, you mean basically, like basically for playing red? Right? Fully, fully aggressive, fully aggressive, fully early game. Yeah, full flip. That's what you mean for that, right? Yeah. yeah. Basically, full flip. Yeah, but if you wanna play full flip and play this way, then. Yeah, at least, might at least well they should like, actually like, go full flip. Yeah, yeah. like, let's say, uh, Volibear, Kalista, Nautilus. Yeah, play the fucking game. True. But if you, like, end up picking Lissin on 1 2, and then an enemy jungler picks champion that makes fun of you for an entire game at 4, then it's already something wrong, right? And then you blind pick Renekton with also Rumble open, which is like. Yeah, you pick red, but an enemy team is, uh, what, how do you call it? Blue, white, green with better red, yeah? Dude, I just hope everyone memes the fucking systems, man. This is C9, dude, C9 were supposed to, like, budget this offseason, but apparently they just made a decision to fucking, uh, they, they made a decision because they could get JoJo and do all this other stuff and yada, yada, yada. So this is supposed to be the prophesized fucking amazing mega roster, right? This is supposed to be the super roster. Hello. It's not, a, it's, not a, it's not a super roster. 
I mean, dude, I honestly, fuck it. I predicted C9 to win 3-0 because I, I, I just, again, I really thought that after getting pulverized last week, I thought that they would find a way to practice properly. And I just think that their players are all better, right? I, I really did think that C9 would just beat Team Liquid. But now at this point, like, I, I don't know. I just hope the systems get fucking memed un un unironically. Like, it's like a meme that they made. They actually made the meme first, but it, it is, like, real. It's, like, how they go about, like, their practice and everything. You know what I mean? Like, you know how each team has their own, like, schedule and everything? They like that all the way of practicing? That's what I mean? Kind of, but because... also, like, their, they're, like, routine. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I'm sure, like, I'm, 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 Yeah, I know what you mean. That, for example, after the scrims, we go and watch games for an hour or... Blah, yeah, blah, exactly, blah, exactly, exactly, exactly. Or, like, before hour, scrims. Yeah. Yes, 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 exactly, yeah. exactly, yes, yes, exactly. So C9 has, like, their own. It is the worst I've ever seen, like, in an esports org. It is, like... <laughs> it... And can you can you elaborate or you can't? No, but I... I know. Like, well, I mean, I don't know if I actually can, but, I mean... Then there's, don't, like, then don't, then don't. Yeah, yeah, like I don't know if I can, but it's like, it's bad. Like it's it's it it's demonstrably bad. That's the thing that's insane. That like makes you want to ram your fucking head against a wall. Is that you can you can like literally point out why it's so bad. And it's like it doesn't. I <laughs> like I don't I don't I don't know. And then even Max talked about it in the final podcast uh, that okay, we so did. Okay, so dear, dear, I'm gonna ask you a question. Yeah, Do they ahead. spend time together outside of work hours or not? No. Well, yeah, that, that, some some of them. Well, no. Well, unless unless you include like the the mandatory uh, workout. No, 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 no. I mean, like actually spending time together and like discussing the game and stuff like this and like. Oh no, 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 no. No. Okay. But that's also a kind of rare thing in esports to have like a team where all five players actually. actually are willing to, in their off time, like, group even as five other coaches and, like, discuss League of Legends. It's a very rare thing. It is rare, yeah. It's certainly hard. Okay, all right, let's talk about the game, let's talk about the game, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, They're gonna okay. kick the next about yep. to be crocodiled by Xinzao and oh, Olaf. Oh, oh my god, no! No! Oh! Oh, maybe not. <laughs> even in, even Renekton, Impact's joining in on the typing. Oh, it's so over. Yeah, but like in the first, in the first place, even if you end up counter picking these champs, these champs are like strong enough to. Oh not wait, give is a he fuck just dead? Oh no, he's no, not. No, he's not. Okay. Okay. And Tawes is actually really good. I mean, I, I hope Eon wins. Yeah. I respect every single virus who plays on Nice, nice dive. They get Berserker, so it's worth. And they also get the TP out of Fudge, and so now Fudge is gonna, yeah. Alright, so current game state, I mean, it's 1.5k gold lead. But C9's comp had to be a header. I mean, they do still have pretty powerful mid-game fight. With Olaf Zinn, and as long as Karma gets like a good mantra E off. I think, um, I think it'll good be okay. mantra. Okay, so, so let's say Karma gets good mantra E, yeah? Well, and then what happens? No, I just mean if, if Olaf and Zinx Olaf and Xinzao or runs into Blade of the Rocking Varus and Zix with Leandris most likely soon, you know? You mad? It's like... He's not gonna have Leandris <laughs> at the next fight. Dude, it's just fucking over. Oh, 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 Omti? He's fine. It's so over. I really like that. And that's all, that's not many people that when you play a jungle with Sandra Sky and mm -hmm. you like start dancing and then like you just basically bait people into the fight and they just turn it because of the item. Mm -hmm. I respect that a lot. He got chunked to thirty percent and then engaged afterwards. Wait, Olaf had no ultimate this fight or what? No, he used it in mid. Oh, Yun Oh my god. I mean, it's nah. just over. The game, the game is so over, yeah. 
Berserker trying to go forward. I mean, he can't. Jesus. I mean, don't get me wrong. I've been in C9 uh, spot many times, and I'm sure they are tilted as fuck, and they know it's hopeless as fuck. What are they supposed to say? Post screenshots of no, the old of I mean, no, yeah, no. Wait, what does C9... What? Okay, blabber. I mean, still. now the only, the only thing they have left is desperation, please. Huh? Or yeah. place oh, to just go home quick. Actually, That's when you crash the wall like this, uh, how long do you have the cooldown for it? Do you know? I'm not sure. Like, wow. I just know they can use it. You can use it instantly when you crash oh, to the tower. I'm just dead. I'm just dead. I'm just dead. All right, they kind of entered. They kind of entered. Is impact dead too? Wait, why did blabber flash? What? Even even if you kill impact, it's not worth. I mean, even if they win this fight, it won't change anything. I think. Oh wait, wait, wait. no, no, no! Hold on. What do you mean? Wait, isn't this Baron? Isn't this Baron? Um, wait, it's Baron, right? They are, they are, they are, it's like minus twenty on it. It's like they're in the bot jungle and they have Zeke alive still. If they all die, then maybe. But. Oh my God, Zeke! Yes. Mm. Impact said two. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait, this is actually an interesting fight. This might be not oh, bad for Okay, 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 okay. They can actually win this. They can win. How did it's, that Zeke kill uh... us? <laughs> okay, Umti picks up Mauve no more. Oh no. Berserker doesn't have flash. He has to be real careful. Oh my god. It's over. It's over. It's over. Yep. Berserker. Yep. I don't, I don't think they can stop this. Yeah, that's soul. They, that's can't, soul. They, they can't stop the soul, but the soul is like whatever. Well, yeah, but hold on. Is the soul actually whatever? Because in like C9's comp wins via extended fights with Karma and like Zin Olaf. So like the 50%, it does come into play like in the fights, no? Yeah, it does come into play, but at the same time, if TL plays well, they will never get in that threshold, right? Because they can just play with range. And True. before the fight starts, okay. they can just poke them out. No, can't happen to anyone. True. Look at T1. One day they leave the trophy, the other day there is a truck waiting for them in front of the office, right? <laughs> True. Oh, bring the ending. Alright, Blabber's dead. Yeah. Honestly, I'm just fucking glad seeing teams that, uh, that try to, like, actually do things to build and foster teams do well, you know, yeah, I guess that's good. Yeah, Team Liquid, go on MSI, that's good. All right, Twitch chat. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like, talked about some stuff. Obviously, C9's fucked um, in a lot of ways. Um, I don't know. I don't know if there's going to be roster changes for C9. I have not heard anything yet. Um, I know it sounds, like, overdramatic uh, to talk about, uh, but I don't think that it's actually overdramatic. I talked about in January when I initially came back uh, to, like, streaming and stuff that I did not think that this would be a super team because there's fundamental problems uh, with the, uh, the core mesh, I think, of personalities with the players. And, um, one of the things that I started talking about, like, a couple of years ago, uh, is, like, stack deck personality teams. Um, I think that's really, really, really important. Um, so, anyways, uh, that aside, I don't think that is necessarily a reason for them to lose to Team Liquid. I do think that's pretty unacceptable. Um, I did talk with Selfmade. I don't know, like, really the extent of, like, what I can say... Uh, on that regard, I do think like I like look. I, I predicted C9 to win 3-0 today. Uh, they didn't win. Uh, they got they got ass blasted. That is just the reality um, of it. Um, C9 spends more money than pretty much any other team in the league for the last couple of years, right? Barring that one Team Liquid roster, I think. And I think I think that FlyQuest roster with Prince might have just maybe been more, or like maybe it was like comparable. Um, 
I think I think it was like pre it was pretty close. But I think like the totality, because again, there, there's like more people on C9, right? Like C9 has a, a big staff and other stuff. Um, th this is like the, the really like confusing thing. And I think a lot of people, so I, I said I would talk about this with SelfMade at the end of the stream, but like a lot of people seemed like perplexed about the, the C9 drama uh, thing that happened like last week, the drama context, any explainers were like, I brought up the Max Waldo podcast um, and then I, I even linked the clips um, in the fucking thing. Uh, Oh, did they delete the quote re Oh, he deleted the quote retweet. Oh, that's why it was deleted. Oh, okay, okay. Anyways, yeah, it's this whole thread of like really just, I, I don't know. I don't even know what to call these people. Um, I don't know. It, it's a really it's a very um I asked the input of why Max would step down as head coach. It is my belief that LS had asked because C9 Bobby did not engage with what was said about the systems and its supposed uh limits on the team. And Bobby has seemingly spun the question about Max's circumstances as an attack on his position. Ultimately, this discussion did not clarify much, but there are clips that speak briefly about Max's region, such as inferior, inferior practice environment, less practice in general, and the absence of culture in which you think and act as unison. Now, whether the systems contribute to these reasons are open to question. As far as we know, the systems, according to Mithy, has been dedicated to exercise, but now includes sleep, diet, effort, and continuous learning with the intention to sustain and retain the player. My two cents, there is a lot more downtime than we think. There may be politics and drama within the team itself due to the special treatment. Three, Max recognized the cards he's dealt with cannot bring him international success based on the above suspicions. Wait, Hey guys, this is Jack Etienne with Cloud9. Uh, so some of the team members this is where the, the first the LS situation, why he was released, and where disappointed we where? were with LS was the radar team, and despite our best efforts working with LS to try to come where is to uh, terms and see eye to eye on how that should work, we we're unable to make that actually happen. I think it's important to note that all players and, uh, and management were aware of these issues and frustrations and our um, mutual efforts to try to resolve them over the last several weeks. So anyways, C9 makes the initial meme of the systems thing, but where, where's the fucking... I don't even remember. Where, where's... I love this fucking thread, dude. These, these fucking morons, man. God, fucking retards. Like, maybe they're not actually retarded. It's just like the way that they arrive at conclusions are like... I, I got fucking quote retweeted by the brother-in-law of the, uh, the fucking company. <laughs> And, and then the guy is calling someone in the comments uh, a liar, and then I ask a question which would obviously immediately contradict w what he's calling the person a liar about. I'm, I'm the one starting drama. What are, we, what are we saying, man? So Max Waldo is coming off of the, the head coach position at C9. Now, a lot of people do not know how... I'm going to use the word precious Max was to C9, Okay. People do not know things that went on inside of C9. Max was a golden child in C9, okay? So when Bobby, when, when I basically said that Max was one of the greatest hires that C9 ever had, and then Bobby affirms that as the brother-in-law of Jack, okay? People do not know things that Max did inside of C9, okay? Okay. Um, and I think that there's multiple people that have probably been through C9 over the years or maybe now are in different departments that would speak to Max's positions within C9 and things that he did that weren't even specifically tied to his job. So Max's departure from the company says more than just his departure. That's what I was alluding to in my fucking tweet chain. When one of the most competent people in your entire company is saying that apparently they couldn't do or create or foster these things, how's that possible? Now, yes, my question's very leading. Anyone with two fucking brain cells could obviously tell that my question is leading. It is obvious. It is fucking bright as the sun can be what the fuck my phrasing was trying to get at here his, his response is about as bland as you could be everything was laid out the way that it was like so look
TLDR, it sucks that, uh, and again, I feel very bad. Like, again, predicted C9 to win today. Okay? Predicted C9 to win today. Thought that they would. Their players, I think, are all better than TLs. I, I genuinely think that. Right? I, 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 there is no doubt in my mind that all of their players are, like, better pound for pound. Right? I have no doubt about that. Um, but... I think it's very apparent, even when watching them last year, right? Even when watching them last year, um, and now especially watching them this year, right? They, they, they almost went 50% in, in uh, you know, an eight-team eight spring split. They almost went 50% with this, with this super roster, okay? There is, <laughs> they're like, oh, what can I even, oh my god, I just want to bash my head against a fucking wall, man. Um, yeah, it sucks. Now, obviously, all teams do things, and, you know, C9 aren't the only ones with uh, problems, or that, you know, C9's not the only one that could do things better, and all this other stuff. The main thing, however, though, is that C9 has way more going for it than so many other teams. That's the main thing, and I think, and this is what I was alluding to in my tweets, by the way, that's what made Max walk away from League. The reason that Max just quit League, I believe, um, from like the convos that we had on stream and the convos that we had on that podcast is because he felt like if C9 couldn't fix these things when C9 is the most capable of fixing these things or doing these things or like if, the, if these problems or these things are, are persistent here, et cetera, yada, yada, yada then um, how bad does it exist elsewhere? Or like, what is the point of trying to, you know, what is the point of trying to do these things elsewhere um, if, if similar hurdles are going to be in, encountered and stuff like that? And basically, that's the sad thing, is that C9 is kind of like the Yankees, uh, in a way, like in the early 2000s, in a way, where... Uh, the Yankees in the early 2000s, they would, they would have the most resources and they would just spend the most money and they would have, like, the most possible aid that they could get. And sometimes they'd win or they'd make really good runs and then other times they just wouldn't win, right? Like, that was the Yankees. That was the New York Yankees. Um, yeah, I don't know. But anyways, C9's results... Even domestically, and I understand that domestically the results look really good, right? Domestically, the the results look good, right? If you if you go to their uh, if you go to their results, right, it looks good. Spring playoffs, right? Fourteen and four round robin, twenty twenty three, twenty twenty three spring playoffs here, three one Golden Guardians, twenty twenty three summer, thirteen and five here. And then they get second, and then Worlds they go they go one and three, right? Uh, here they go, oh, they go 8 and 6. They almost went 7 and 7, right? And then here, 2022, uh, this was, uh, yeah, this is, okay, so this is 2022. Uh, this is with Max, right? Summer, this is where they had the, the late start, right? They started like 0-5 or something. I can't remember what the fuck this was. I think this was the late start. Um, I think they started 0-5, something like that. Um, 3-0, right? So domestically, it looks like, you know, things are fine. Um, but I think when you compare it to, like, what it should be, given what they have and the stability that they have and the infrastructure, because, again, you have to know the ins and outs of, like, other teams and, like, what goes on. Wait, they, oh, they actually have his full name, Maxwell Waldo here. So fucking cool. Um, that's where I think that it gets kind of uh, bad. Anyways, I'm only talking about this because Selfmade asked about it. People asked about it on Twitter. Um, and then, uh, yeah. So that's it. Anyways, that's all.